I don't think I can finish. <laughs> Hey everyone, Joel Lance here. Today we are in Hobe Sound. I believe that's how it's pronounced. H-O-B-E space sound. Hobe Sound, guys, at Courtney's. Courtney's Restaurant, guys, to do their big burger challenge. Yes, that's right. So here we have a massive burger, a five patty burger with five slices of cheese, also a massive bucket of fries. That's right. Somebody once said this bucket was five pounds of fries. I really, really, really hope not. Plus a vanilla milkshake, guys. That's just a lot, a lot of fries. So anyway, a lot of fries, a lot of burgers, Milkshake, sounds good. And I'm here with good friend Mr. Nathan Figueroa. He is in there, I don't know if you can see him. But anyway, here with Nathan Figueroa, also his dog as well. So that's pretty cool, guys. So yeah, down here in kind of like an hour above Fort Lauderdale, so uh, east coast of Florida nonetheless. So yeah, let's go on in, let's have some fun. We're gonna have 30 minutes to complete this challenge. If we complete it, we get it for free, and I believe a t-shirt, and if not, we gotta pay for it. So let's go on in, have some fun, and let's eat some food. And so here are the challenges. Definitely a good sized challenge, guys. Like, this is a massive, massive bucket of fries, and they're <laughs> very crispy. This is gonna be a little rough, to yeah. say the least. Yeah. Uh, but here with Nate Fix, of course, if you're not familiar with him, guys, definitely check him out, in info down below. Nate has been in this game for a long time. Nate's actually one of the guys that I watched getting into food challenges. Oh, sick. You're an OG, man. <laughs> Appreciate um, it. So yeah, here we got the burger, though. We got the milkshakes. All that good stuff. I'm definitely probably gonna dump these fries out just for your visual sake. And yeah, that's here. about it. But yeah, 30 minutes, get the meal for free. That's about it. Nate, ready to speed? Yes, I am. <laughs> well, that, let's get started here just moment too. Yeah. All right, so let's get started. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna try to get Same here. out of the bucket. This is not working the way I hope. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, I kind of took any Yeah, that was, there's a lot actually, there's a lot more in that bucket than I thought. Yeah. Um, that is now a like, massive amount of French fries. Hold on, I gotta move this so you guys can see the sheer amount of fries this yeah, is. I hope you guys can try to conceptualize. That's crazy. This is ridiculous. Yeah. Um, anyway, so that's about it though. I'm definitely have catch up. I'm gonna get into that. But uh, 30 minutes. Nathan, ready to get going? Yeah, let me just put my water over here so it's not in your way. Good drinks. Yes. Start right there. So you ready? Yes. All right, guys. So in three, two, one, start. Let's go. Looks very delicious. Is it okay if I donate my pickles to him? I'll yeah, lettuce, them. tomato, pickles are an option because not everybody oh, okay, okay. has this. Here. Has that. There you go. Pickles. All right. Rocks rock. 14 seconds in, I haven't even taken a bite. Mm -hmm. mm. It is a good burger, though. Mm hmm. That set up anywhere? Maybe right um, there. Will no, be right. Camera shot. He has one right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Getting my ketchup pile, guys. Just my. That's my thing. Mm. Burgers cook nicely. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where today we're here at Courtney's do their burger challenge. So definitely a pretty interesting burger challenge being it has this massive, massive, massive container of fries, a big bucket of fries, like literally a bucket, literally it came in a little bucket, which was kind of cool. Cheesy. Now there was definitely a little bit of a uh, query as regards to how much fries we were going to get. Nathan said one gentleman told me it was five pounds. It definitely wasn't five pounds, but it was probably like a legit three pounds of fries. Napkins, that's something I'm missing. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna napkin the french fries as well, we saw in pictures, some of them were like straight cut fries where these were crinkle cut, um, which I think did potentially add a bit of difficulty, but I mean, crinkle cut fries are pretty good overall. So we'll have to kind of see how those turn out if we can even get to them. So the burger itself had two and a half pounds of beef, um, then the buns, your toppings, etc. And then again, you also had a vanilla milkshake in addition to the fries. So coming on about two minutes in, both doing well, getting these burgers down, these patties. Uh, onto this mountain of fries. Mm. Right? 
Overall, the burger was tasting really good. They uh, cooked the burger very nicely. We both asked for ours about, um, I believe, like a medium rare, medium. Um, and they were definitely like about a medium or so, but like a real medium. They were very nicely cooked, very nice and juicy. Really was enjoying it. And overall, a, you know, just solid burger, really no complaints. And I'm sure the rest of their food at the restaurant, the rest of their burger specifically, would probably follow suit. Uh, it was pretty funny when we showed up to the challenge, which we called and clarified. They're like, yeah, yeah, just show up. And so we showed up, the gentleman, the owner actually had to go like get milk for our milkshake. So that was, that was pretty funny. We're like, hey, I guess they don't have milk, but we needed our milkshakes for the challenge. So we were glad that he was able to go and get it. All right, now the part I'm actually worried about, for both the integrity and safety of our mouths, this is a lot of crispy, crunchy fries. I'm going in on the ketchup, brother. Mm. Once the ketchup, that's the key. It's the secret, guys. Let's go. I didn't know you were that far already. <clears throat> I've only got two baddies left. Pizza. Take your time, bro. I pretty much told Joel that I was not going ham on this. And I agree, nobody's going ham today. Just enjoy them. Good old burger. And that Florida weather. Beautiful, huh? It's snowing back up in Canada. That is something that really doesn't happen down here. I'm not sure if there was a record or anything for the challenge, um, but that being said, we were just kind of going into this quite leisurely. Uh, neither of us were really wanting to give a race. Uh, specifically, we both said we weren't going to race at all. We were just going to uh, hope to complete this challenge, and that was ultimately was the goal, to get the meal for free. I did speak incorrectly earlier. There was not a t-shirt, or at least we were not offered a t-shirt, but we did get the free meal, which had a value of $30. So, you know, pretty solid, no complaints in that regard. So you really don't like pickles, right? No. Pickles. Thank you, Laura. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Would you like the taste? Is it sweet? No, it's not Oh, yeah. Here my good friend Mr. Nathan Figueroa. If you're not familiar with Nathan Figueroa, uh, he is a long time kind of food challenger, menu challenger, mukbanger, etc. Um, food YouTuber, I guess you could say. About five and a half minutes, Jim. As long as I'm not like scraping them on the side of my mouth, it's not bad. But that's careful precision. Place them into my oral cavity. Hashtag, I tried to make this sound scientific. And he was actually one of the first food YouTubers that I watched. He was uh, definitely part of the first individuals that I watched when I was getting into food challenges, when I started to actually watch kind of food videos on YouTube. A lot of you know that once you kind of dive into them, you find somebody you like, uh, you just kind of keep going down the rabbit hole and you find other eaters, um, you know, and they all have their own styles, their own different ways, um, which I always thought was really cool. And so it's always nice to meet up with Nathan again. <sighs> Done. <laughs> I need to, hey, you're done the burger. That's a feat in itself. I need to knock you guys to grab the paper down. Oh, scheitzer. I didn't just do that. Oh my God, are you good? Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this. That was close? I'm gonna put this right behind this. Yeah, that's good. I'm sorry. I know you're good. Mm. Okay guys, so I completed the burger in a mere seven minutes while he did it like in two minutes. Pretty crazy. Hmm, I guess I have an excuse, but I'm not gonna say. Uh, <clears throat> oh, that feels good. So, he has pretty much half the fries down. What, what do you do with this? Ketchup. Ketchup? <sighs> hmm. Ketchup is key. I, I, I wrap it all the time. Or shake. Or shake. I'll give you that. Now we gotta take down these fries. Mm. A lot of fries. Yeah. Mm. I don't know, it's actually pretty good. 
It's not bad, it's not that soft. No. No. I'll give it a try. I do like a milkshake. While I didn't get to actually see too much of this Hobe Sound area, it was pretty close to the water and what I did see was very beautiful. Of course, all this in the beautiful Florida weather. And I really mean that, beautiful weather. All right guys, a thousand minutes in to fries and chill. My mouth integrity is questionable. Nate, Godspeed brother, Godspeed. The crinkle cut fries, I was really anticipating them just shred our mouths because they had a really, really big crunch to them. However, if I carefully positioned them in my mouth and uh, like just the right way, it wasn't too abrasive, definitely avoiding the edges, kind of as I mentioned. Um, and they were going down pretty well. Uh, Nathan was absolutely crushing this challenge. We were both heading in for that uh, 30 minute mark for sure. Do you like the fries though? It's good. Yeah, they're bad. Hmm? <clears throat> Which does make it easier. And 10 minutes in, both doing really well. Mm. Nate's crushing it, probably has like half his fries gone. <clears throat> yeah, about half. Not doing too bad. Myself. <clears throat> it's not that I'm going slow, it's just that you're going fast. I'm, def I'm just telling them that. They're probably like, oh my God, you're so slow. You realize it's only been 10 minutes. It has only been 10 minutes, guys. Uh -huh. Oh my God, there's, there's no such thing as slow. There's been countless failures on this challenge. So the fact that we're making through it at all is a really good start. But with that, everyone, I believe that's all the info I have for you today. Uh, pretty straightforward challenge, solid burger challenge. Huge thanks to the staff for the good food, the hospitality. Huge thanks to Nathan for coming out, and I'll let you enjoy the rest of the video. All right, so just over 11 minutes in, I got my milkshake left. That's about it. Nate's crushing it. And we'll have the win here, hopefully, not jinxing it yet, momentarily. I don't think I finished. Huh? That was good. Whipped cream. And about 11 minutes, 51 seconds for myself. Nate, guys, almost done. He's absolutely crushing it. Just a few fries. Only partial of a milkshake left. So keep it up, brother. <coughs> Excuse me. Inhaling <coughs> milkshake there, don't recommend it. Oh yeah, crushed it. Keep it up. Nate will be done here in just a momentum. You know, my time, my goal coming in here, yeah. was like, I'm comfortable 20 minutes. Yeah. Oh, you're definitely on track for that. Right? You all have to appreciate the care and concern that Nate's taking when he dips his fry into that milkshake. It is such a delicate dunk, followed by the most kind and courteous taps to make sure it's just perfectly covered and smothered to the exact caliber and level of his likeliness. <clears throat> That's really funny. It's my nose is getting runny. I don't do this so, by the way. I don't know why. Hey, if you like the flavor, right? Mm -hmm. Might as well. Mm -hmm. well I don't want to. I don't want to lose any of it. Is that be one? Like I said, great appreciation has to be given for the delicacy, care that's going into his dunking. So 14 and a half minutes in, Nate is down to just like a handful of fries, guys. One piece of tomato, and remen rem just like remnants, half about half of the milkshake. <clears throat> he 
said his goal was 20 minutes, and he's going to beat that. I have confidence. Okay, guys, so we have most of the fries done. We have this lacking tomato. Good <laughs> tomato. All about the health, healthy vegetables. Currently 15 minutes in. I'm gonna take out my strategy here. Is to take out the big fries. These are the big, I don't know if this is gonna fit. Well, it does fit. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> That's kind of what she said, but. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and finish this. Seventeen minutes, ten seconds in. Nate's just down to a couple of fries there. Absolutely crushing it. Going to come in well under that thirty-minute mark. Let's go, Nate. Keep it up, dude. There you go. You got a minute and a half. Come under your goal. You got it. About 19 minutes in, we're just admiring the scenery, including the beautiful Florida sun and a dog. Uh, Nate is just finishing up here, guys. Literally down to like three pieces of french fry. Just a very small portion of shake. So he's coming. Definitely, uh, he's coming in for his 20 minute goal. He had a goal of 20 minutes, he's definitely coming in there. Had a last more. What's that? I look for a more. More milkshake, yeah. There we go. Woo. That's it. Job, minutes. Pretty much on the dot. It took me to eat this. Honestly, that's probably that's the time I was really aiming for. Um, coming in here, I told Joe that I was not going to be speeding in nothing. Plus, I'm not really a good speeder to begin with. But anyways, that was a lot of fries. I have to admit, but my mouth isn't chopped up at least. Yeah, it, it was a little less abrasive than I thought it was going to be. Uh -huh. um, still a little bit of deterioration, but I'll give it that, man. It was, overall, it was pretty good. I have no complaints. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so then we just finished up. Nate just shy of 20 minutes. Absolutely crushed it. That was his goal, so you absolutely fulfilled that. Congratulations on that, bro. Thanks, man. You smashed it. That was all right. Uh, it was very delicious, guys. I uh, really did enjoy it. Those fries, definitely not quite as abrasive as I would have thought, but still a little rough on the mouth. Um, burger was really good, no complaints here. So yeah, guys, Courtney's would recommend. Milkshake was solid, so yeah, pretty cool challenge. If you're ever in the Hobe Sound area, feel free to come stop on by. Nate, any words? I'm sorry, I was burping the whole time. It's all right. <laughs> talking. It's all right. Um, I, I, thought the burger was, I thought the burger was good, it was juicy. The milkshake, I gotta say, was the highlight of everything. The milkshake, yeah? Yes, I wish I wouldn't have used the fries. I should have just used ketchup like you did and save the milkshake towards the end because I was telling my head, I was saying in my head during the last fight, I wish I had a little bit more milkshake. The milkshake was 10 out of 10. Just to wash it down. Yes, yes, for sure. Excellent. Well done, everybody. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy the rest of the day. That's about it. It's just a good challenge. Feel free. Feel free. I think maybe a t-shirt, but we'll find out about that. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, guys, until next time, stay happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. That's it. Peace. <coughs>Huge thanks to our friends Mike for coming out. Always nice to meet people, guys. I tell you, I welcome everybody to my events. It's fun. It's a great way to see, explore. Any words, man? It's amazing to watch him eat. There you go. Well, hey, thank you so much, man. Much appreciated again. And uh, let's go enjoy some more of this Florida sun. Laybacks working like a George Jones. Rolling at the window and ice cold beer sitting in the console. Memory laid up in the headlights.
got me reminiscing all the good times. I'm getting easy straight on my times. Everyone, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. If you click my face right here, you can subscribe. Yes, that's right. Click my face, subscribe, guys. It helps me out, it helps you out. Then you don't miss an upload. And hopefully, I can meet you when I come to your city. Also, click a video right here. I specifically picked two videos. Yes, that's right. Two videos specifically for you right here. So click a video right now. Get that going. And it's going to end. So click one quick. Let's go. Let's go. And have a great day.